Hi. Hi. I'm Chip Hamlin. And I'm Earl Prescott. And this is... Tackle, Tackle Talk, Talk with, with Chip, Chip and, and Earl. Earl. How you doing today, How you doing today, Chip? That's uh, usually I go first there, and I ask you, how you doing today, Earl? And then... Chip, I'm doing just fine. How are you doing? You know what? I'm doing better than a tall Norwegian pine swaying in the spring breeze. That's good. I'm doing about as good as Cornwash. Cornwash. The world's first corn-based cleaning product. Cleaning product. Chip. You seem what? agitated today, I am, right? I'm a bit agitated, yeah. I have no home. I'm living, this is like my, my third or fourth day living in the van. Well, I got some advice for my you. My family is MIA, missing in action. Mm. The thing I've learned lately is that when the world gives you shit, you gotta just learn to embrace the shit. Chip, you're right. Or let me ask you something. You've turned over a new leaf Have recently. you ever seen a pig? A couple times, yeah. Yeah. What do you do when uh, you get stuck in the mud and you step on some poo? Wipe my shoe off. You know what the pig does? He asks for some more. You're talking about a police officer or an actual swine? Well, I was, I was talking about the farm animal. The point is, really, the thing I've learned is you got to just give up. Chip, Go this, ahead, Rain. Go ahead, Sky. Really rain on old Chip Hamlin. This is a real... Soak me to the bone. Strong storm today. Do what you want with me, Lord. Ooh, Andy does not look good. He, <laughs> he looks, looks sickly, doesn't completely he? Completely soggy. Whoa. That was a strong... Did you feel that strong wind there? Yep. <sighs> Fell it right down to my core. I feel a little bit hypothermic, I have to say. <laughs> doesn't bother me, though. Ooh, Chip... Today we're in, oh, we got a black bear. We're on uh -oh. the trail of a black bear. Hey, black bear. I see him. Oh, there he goes. Look at his little butt. Oh, I think you scared him away, Prescott. I'm not sure that you hit him. Yeah, you going to shoot the bushes? Oh, I just was looking for him, Chip. Chip, today we're in Utah in the Leighton Lowe's hunting oh, for Lowe's. apparently black bear. Mm -hmm. um, I'm gonna Anything that moves and has flesh can be con consumed for nutrients. Chip, I'm just feeling a little bit agitated today, but you know what? I shouldn't. You know, Chip Hamlin turned over a new leaf recently. Turned over. Not quite sure why. I couldn't even tell him, tell you why he. Did turned you hear over me when I was um? I was crying in the van last night. I heard it. I was crying. Oh, he's. And I was thinking about my ex-wife, and I was thinking about someone else who wronged me. And uh, it just became too much. I was crying and crying, and all of a sudden, something just snapped. Yeah. And now, Chip don't give a f It was your waistband, because you've... You are pulling on your pants so much trying to get them off that you snapped your waistband. That's what the snapping sound was. Earl? You are trying to pull your pants off, or I don't know what you were doing. Earl, that wasn't the point of the story. I did that afterwards, because I was feeling so good. Where did this bear go? I hope I didn't, uh, get any on you. No. No, I did. Where? So what's Chip, where did this bear go? Well, I don't even, I'm not sure you hit it. Did I don't think hit I hit it because I would you have seen a little bit too high. I would I have thought. seen a, a blood. Because you know what? You were too agitated and you can't concentrate when you're no. agitated. Oh, you know what these little flowers are? It's called Queen Anne's Lace. How do you know that? Yeah, because it's mm. got a very uh, paradigmatic kind of flower shape. Chip, let me tell you a yeah, story poison. about paradigmatics. Where did this bear go? He's trotting. Do we want to kill a bear, Chip, or do we want to kill a... I like killing bears. A deer, or something that we can eat. I mean, I don't know. We can eat a bear. Are oh, you, you in the mood? what we can do with a bear, though? Chip, what's we can this? carve out all of its guts and live inside its fur. Just now. Uh-oh. Look up. It's going to drop on you from the Droppings, top of the tree? Droppings, Chip. Um, when I shoot a bear and I scare it, usually they run. Sometimes they go defecation. Maybe you scared him so much he pooped. I scared him so much I pooped he, he made a... Um... <laughs> you know who that reminds me of? 
Andy. Andy. <laughs> <laughs> yep, Andy. I'm going to start calling him Toy Story. <laughs> Wait, why? Because he's such a wuss. <laughs> I still don't get it. Why would not you just call him wuss? Hey, Andy, you're a wuss. Toy Story is funny, creative. <laughs> Chip, where did that, where did that <laughs> you bear You like Tim go? Allen? Yeah. Remember uh, Tool Time? Yeah. That's that my kind of guy. Tim the Tool Man Taylor. Yeah, Tim the Tool Man Taylor. You know who my kind of guy was? Oh, I think he pushed again. No. The neighbor. Al Borland. Oh, yeah. He's, he's got, got the beard and the rugged the flannel. and the flannel. And a little bit of a belly. He's got a nice round face to him. D- it's kind of like a little bearded cherub, isn't he? Kind of wanted to squeeze I ha- his I always cheeks. had a little crush. Oh, was this a command center? On uh, Jonathan Ooh. Travis Thomas. JTT. Yep. He was always pretty good. He was smooth as a baby. Did you know that he was the sign limba? The what? The Lion King? Really? The science limba. Kimba, oh. Simba, the cat lion. Is that the one where all the animals are jumping around and they're praying, they're colored and they're singing and then some kind of, I don't know. There might be some food up here. Maybe we can, maybe we can, uh, so there's a park ranger up here. I ask him for a donation. Well, um, we should probably tell people You've that got a works. gun. I do have a gun chip. You could, well, you wouldn't have to hurt him, you just. I found that you can do a lot by threatening. Let's see what. Ooh, so look, look at, at this. Oh, fire risk. Uh, oh, we've unlocked oh. a new lookout point. Yeah, look at that view. Look at that. That looks great, Chip. I can't wait to go to Utah. Whoopsies. Oh. Leighton Lake District. Is there any food in there? There's the fire risk today is low, medium, severe, and extreme. I, I no, can't. That's a lot. I can't that's tell which one it is. Wide range, isn't it? Let's look at some of these, these oh, stats here. Harold Hap Purcell. Alaska. Wait, what, what, what's the column name? Go up, go up. Board of Directors. Board. Yeah. Alternate. Alternate. Alaska Higher Education Candy Crafts and Tragic Locals. Huh. Interesting. You know, there are things that you learn every day. Is that Andy? Ooh, I was going to take his little newsboy cap off with a little bullet whiz but sometimes i think about jumping off a place like this you want me to try it yes you're right Earl? i got hurt there's the ankles I'm, yeah it well, wasn't that and my far. knees i think maybe you should go to the gym a little bit more i didn't think that was gonna hurt but well we can't really afford I'm, the medical bill i mean that was probably a little bit Foolish. Yeah. Well, we lost that bear. We lost that bear. Now we're no on deer. the trail of a Cadillac. But you know what, Earl? The rain we're stopped. We're turning over a new leaf. The rain stopped, and we're turning over a new oh, leaf. Oh, oh, oh. What do we got there? We got a white-tailed deer. In the distance, we have another white-tailed deer. Chris, we might be able to... We're at a high advantage point, vantage point right now. We might be able to get a, a, our glass, which is... Slang for binoculars. Look out for people, too, because they actually have the most food and money. I'll keep an eye open. All right, Chip, do you see any... any? I don't see anyone. Pets? I mean, not pets. Look at that. Ooh. Oh, 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 you hear that? Oh, there's my bear. Oh, there so he's back bear. again. You see him? There he... Not quite. Nope. Never quite enough <laughs> to see him. <coughs> Never Excuse quite me. enough to see <laughs> him. Oh, that's a warning call, though, Chip. You can tell. Well, I got a warning call for you. Hey, bear. You better watch out. We got guns. That's that's a Chip Hamlin warning call. <laughs> Chip, I have a warning call for him. Ready for it? Yeah. Mm. Earl, that sounded like your duck call. I just farted. <laughs> I've been holding that one I in know. since the van. That's your duck call. I heard him all last night in the van. Well, Chip, I'm not a good farter. I'm not like a... I like a big... I like to get a good wet slapping one, you know? Do you have one ready? Do you have one lined up? No. Oh, what's that? That's the black bear warning call again. Look at this guy. Oh, there he is. He's warning everybody, isn't he? Well, we're back on the trail of our bear today, Chip. Let's get him. We're going to get him and we're going to eat him for breakfast. You ever read the Bernstein Bears? It's Berenstein. <laughs> oh, there you go again. 
One it's thing I didn't weak. understand about those bears, the Berenstein bears. Since when, since when can bears be Jewish? Is the bears were Jewish? Oh, because that was Berenstein. I mean, they're Jew bears. Berenstein. That's well, basically not, what that means, doesn't it? Not quite sure that they were actually practicing J Jewish people. I mean, you don't have to be practicing to be a Jew. Be a Jew bear. Chip, why don't we look at a, the call, a call or something? You want to look at a call? Listen to a call or okay. something? Okay. You're in charge, Andy. What do we got? Andy, do we have anybody on the phone? He's going to cry. Let's, let's, let's put a patch of call through. Ready? Let's go. Go ahead, Andy. Uh, hi there. Uh, I'm Officer Anthony Jaden uh, with the Lorenga Police Department. Hi. Uh, I just wanted to know if I'm speaking with uh, Mr. Chip Hamlin. Yes. Excellent. Uh, hi, Chip. Uh, may, may I call you Chip? Uh, Can I call you Chip? Nope. Uh, I have some unfortunate news. Uh, basically, your former landlord, Barry, has, well, he died. Oh, my God. Oh. What the? Yeah, witnesses says he was struck by a vehicle and then brutally beaten by his driver. So, you know, we're still really early in the investigation, but, you know, we're hoping to calling around and talking to people who knew him, hopefully get some kind of lead. Do you mind if I ask you some questions? Okay. Excellent. As a uh, former tenant of his, do you know anyone that like harbored any harsh feelings towards Barry? Someone that would want to cause him harm or nope. have some sort of vendetta against him? Yep, nope, definitely not. No. Okay, uh, well... Definitely not. We'll be calling around you know, a couple of the residents in his apartment, you know, see see if anyone had anything out for Barry, someone didn't like him, maybe, who knows. Yeah, uh, if, you know, If you think anything that, you know, helps, think of any lead or anything, please call me. Uh, don't hesitate. Yeah, uh, he was very yeah. well liked. Uh, so, yeah, thanks again, and, you know, okay. any other... Oh. Anything else, just call my uh, office. Yeah. Okay. That's for me. Thank you. Thanks, officer. My God, Chip. Your previous landlord, Barry, is dead. It's hard to believe. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 um, uh, oh. Oh, there he goes. Was that there? No. You just shot the tree. Well, I wasn't sure. I wanted to kill whatever that was. It's a shame about Barry, though, isn't it? Uh, it's a sh it is a shame. Speaking of bears, yeah, I he's right in his prime. Too. Kill this bear, Three. <laughs> Barry. Yeah. yeah, let's yeah. kill Barry. Yeah. Nope, we don't have to because he's already dead. Chip, now let's not Barry. be insensitive. I like it because we're killing Bear. But you know, Barry. Yeah, no, Barry was was a great a great landlord, wasn't he? I mean, for all of his flaws, he really was a true gentleman in, of sorts. I heard he had a family, too. Did he? Or yeah. in Willapeg. Oh. Kids are going to be lonesome now without Dad. Well, I'm sure he brought home a good living with all of his uh, yeah, realty money. You know, I'm a pretty good father figure. Maybe I could... Take him under your wing and in. maybe raise him? Yeah, because his wife's probably going to be lonely. Oh, oh, oh. There he goes. Chip, I'm running. I, I'm having a hard time. Oh, oh, that might have been a flesh wound. It's all right. If it slows him down, where'd he go? I think he ran off. Chip, if I got a flesh wound on him, there there could be some blood on the ground. Even if it's a slow, even if it's a low amount of blood, I'll take it. Yeah, no. I mean, it's a real shame. Yep. Real shame about Barry. But you know what? It's time and place to be, you know, consoled and con condolenced. And it's not right now. It's not right now. It's hunting time with Maybe Chip. Maybe I'll Monroe. give a eulogy at his funeral. What is this? Droppings. You know what I'd say? I'd say. Rest in peace, Barry. Today You'll be missed. We lost a uh, man. He wasn't very great, and I'm glad he's dead. Oh. I'm sorry. That's what I would say. Chip, I would say you know, maybe you should say something a little bit more nice, especially since his family will be there, especially his kids. And I'd also say, Barry's wife, 
I'm a very able and manly man. I can provide for the family. And I'm better than Barry. Hmm. So if you're listening, call me. Chip, that reminds me of a story. I once knew a, a gentleman who was murdered. Hmm. Um, what was his name? Which one? Terry? No, Troy. Jerry? Clint. Troy. Troy. Troy was a good friend of mine. We went to high school together for many, many years. And um, we actually learned how How many years did you go to high school? Four. Oh. Okay. Uh, we, we, we grew up together. We learned hopscotch for the first time. We... That's put, a girl's game, Earl. Put scotch tape over our mouths for the first time. And we also took our first shot of scotch for the first time. <laughs> what? Did you do something with your crotch for the first time? No. <laughs> oh, because it rhymes with sc- It rhymes with you. <laughs> no. But, no, um, Troy was uh, actually uh, went into geology while I went into radiology. And Troy went to, um, are you familiar with the volcano Mount Vesuvius? No. It's the one in Pompeii that killed about 30 or 40 people. Uh, no. Anyways, we went to Mount Vesuvius, and lo and behold, the first day he was there, it erupted and killed Look him. Look at that big bear butt. Hmm. Chip, I'm really... You think she's in heat? Tired. That's a good-looking bear behind, isn't it? It's a bear behind. Get it? Oh, oh, she's limping. limping. I don't think you're missing there, Prescott. Oh, oh I had to reload. But look at it. She's out in the open. Come on, Prescott. Working on it. Hoof it. Oh, oh, you're going to go for the long distance shot? Oh, that could have done it. Oh. Oh, boy. This is getting brutal, isn't it? Oh, there she goes. I, I think we're going to have to chase her, Earl. Yeah, we're going to get that damn bear. Well, we're under, we've got her tracked, so. We got her tracked. Well, if people I, if don't know this, but Earl is a great tracker. If you ever if I hit her once, she'll be bleeding. So she'll be bleeding. How do you know that she's, it's a she though? Ah, she looked kind of feminine to me. I saw that nice big behind, and I Troy. W- it just looked appealing, so I assumed. Troy, let me tell you something, Chip. What happens to the human body when it's exposed to a very high um, amount of molten lava? It's it's uh, quite possibly the most painful death known to mankind. I mean, you're literally melting down to to your bones. I could think of worse. Um. Anyways, uh, Troy was exp- I think a lava just doused him. Very low. Chip, today's not my best day, nor is it Barry's. How could it be very low? Well, how is that possible? I don't know. Let's let's you see shot it about one. eight times. Vital oh, hit. That's a v- blood oh. splatter. That's a vital hit. That's Chip. a splatter. I love a good uh, blood that's splatter. A hit. Are you ready to claim our bear? Did you see my splatter I made at the van last night? No. <laughs> you must have cleaned it up before. Harold I... did. Harold's I the got raccoon. Him. He was sleeping in the corner. And I just splattered all over him. Oh no! <laughs> it was oh. all in his fur. It was all stuck together. Chip, you know what? For a vital hit, this bear's this got a bear's lot of vitals. Got along. Chip, you know what? Corn wash. Corn wash. You can clean up your splatters with it. Chip, you know what? I had a, I look had a. That. Look at him. He very just, low. Very low again, but it, very quick. I saw healing. a vital hit though. Those blood splatters. I mean, it's not merely a trail. These are splatters. Oh yeah. Like, but, every once but, in a while, its organs just kind of explode with blood. I guess. But chip bears are very versatile creatures. Oh yes. Especially the bigger ones. Do you know that they make porridge? Bears? Remember when the Goldilocks came in there? Because they were making the good porridge, although some of them were too hot, some of them were too cold. And then she took oh. those Jew bears' porridge. Oh, oh, Chip! I think we've got a dead is bear it, body. Is it dead? Oh, it's uh, it's certainly deceased, Chip. Oh, oh! Did you hear that? That's a little coyote. It's a little yip. Look, oh, look, look, at, look that. at that! Oh, wow. yeah! Look at that rear end, though. Ready to see if it actually was a female or not? Look at yep, that! I told you. One thousand seventy-two bucks for that. Chip, Flesh, my sacrum, <laughs> coccyx. Oh yeah. Flesh, right femoris, and then pure flesh. That's a fleshy good bear. The first hit was actually the most effective with 59%. Yeah. Look at, well, right in, he wasn't really, she wasn't really expecting that. She was just walking away and it went right in her. Doesn't that start to look good after a while? 
On chip, we made about a thousand dollars for that, but we won't end up seeing most of that because that goes right to the the hunting preserve that we're hunting on yeah. today. In fact, we get a very small percentage. Yeah, in fact, we typically rack up debt for most trips because it costs us an arm and a leg just it, to get out here. It costs an arm and a leg. Where's so, the coyote, coyote? As they call them, coyotes can bag you actually a pretty decent amount of money, and they they take a right. very small amount of death. You think we can get a coyote in the van? That might be a nice addition. Yeah, maybe it could be a friend of uh, Troy's. It's raining again. Harold's. Nope, you know what? Turning over a new leaf. Mm -hmm. A little rain just means you're a little bit wet. But water is the source of all life. That's true. Yeah, and God. Chip, I had a, I had a, a discovery the other day. Well, what was that? Well, back when I had my house, I had some corn wash. And I put it in a little bowl... And I accidentally put it in the microwave. Uh oh. Guess what happened? Uh, I had made some warm corn wash. No. It started popping. <gasps> I made popcorn wash. Popcorn <laughs> I didn't even think of that one, Pris. Got me. Popcorn wash. Just another use for the most versatile cleaning product and corn based on the planet. Pick it up now. It's the black bear of cleaning products. Exactly. You know what? I figure there's a practical use for popcorn wash. Say you really need some extra grit in your cleaning. Hmm. You know? To get out those tough stains. Tough stains. And You're going to need fish to smell. pop that pop into popcorn. Just doesn't leave, That does corn it? into popcorn. And really, really make it. You uh, eat it with the movies? I mean, does it like get like a gravy on it? Oh, 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 oh. Look at that. Get him. Get him, Prescott. Coyote. Blast him into bits. I gotta Put it him. right up his rectum. Right up the rectum. Oh, he ran off. I guess you don't need a rectum. That was a miss. You gotta reload, Prescott. Chip, you know what? I'm turning over a new leaf. Yeah? What well, leaf I, is that? Uh, well, I tried to, tried to kill that coyote. All right. Think I got him? I don't know. That's not fair. There was a bit of a scuffle up here. Yeah. It looks like a pretty good hit, and that's a pretty small animal. I suspect it probably. Uh, oh, 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 oh. That's some droppings. You scared him. Nope, that's sorry. Flesh, that's wound. flesh wound. Just a flesh wound. That's, that's not surprising fair. to me. Chip, while I'm chasing down this poor dead animal, do you want to. Uh, bleed rate very low. For a coyote? I could have. I should have obliterated him. You should have smashed him into a bunch of bits. Chip, do you want to go to the tweets while yeah, I'm hunting this tweets. poor dead animal? Yeah, you can tweet at us. Uh, actually, you got to send it to at Syntopacy Gaming and hashtag Tackle Talk, and we'll get your tweets. Why don't you go ahead? Here's our first tweet. All right. Uh, this is from Megazord1877. It says, if you had to be a Power Ranger, which ranger would you be? That's hashtag Tackle Talk. Hashtag Power Rangers. I'm sorry, Chip. Get rid of that one yep. a little bit. Can I answer that one first? Absolutely. Well, yep. you got to go by process of elimination. We know right off the bat, not going to be a pink ranger, because that's a lady. And we're not going to be the yellow ranger, excuse me, the yellow ranger, because that's an Asian. Can't be the black ranger, because that's a black guy. Can't be the blue ranger, because that's a nerd guy. So, you either got to go with the red ranger... Or the Green Ranger. Me, I don't really like ponytails much, so uh, I go with the T-Rex one, the red one. How about you, Earl? Oh, uh, I, I was just going to go with the, the Pink Ranger. <coughs> Andy would Kim be the Blue Ranger. Kimberly. Yeah, Andy probably would because <laughs> he'd be Billy. A, this bi little Billy was gay. What? She wasn't. Did you forget to turn you this overalls. the safety off on this? Chip, what's this? Chip. Oh, oh, look at that. Look where I got it. Flesh, him. pelvis, right femoris. Look where I got Another this. Another eleven hundred bucks. Puppy. How about that? What Another female. You're really dog. going after the women today, aren't you? You know what, Chip? It's what they deserve. We got a comment on the Twitch chat. We're live streaming twitch.tv slash syntopsy. And it says, from Sierra Vanna, Panda, it says, what am I doing wrong? I microwaved corn wash and my microwave went into a coma. 
Uh, hey, you probably uh, left a spoon or a fork in there. That'll do it. Maybe you... I mean, you should probably cover it, because you don't want it splattering all yeah, over the roof. Yeah, it'll splatter. You gotta... If you think about the popcorn, you just gotta put it in a bag, right? You got. You have to cover... You, you have to put, put it, put in, it in, in a bag. That's a good you shot. You gotta put it in a bag. Thanks, Chip. It was not a good shot. It was a fair shot. But it was enough to bring down... A dog. Did you ever learn karate, Earl? Couple times. Oh, are we still doing the tweets? Oh yeah. Get to do There's the more of those. This one is from at Seaman Crib. Seaman Crib. They say, Mother Nature or Father Time? Why are they parents? Is my father going to kill me? Hashtag tackle dog. Hmm. Oh, that's a. I don't understand the question. That's some. Interesting one. Well, Mother Nature or Father Time? Mother. Why did you go for Mother? You went with the Pink Ranger and you go for the Mother Nature too? Chip, I'm turning over a new leaf. Is that a leaf where you become a lady? No. no. I'd be the Red I'd, Ranger too, me I'd too. I'd consider you if you did. I just want you to know. No. Andy's going to be a... <laughs> Dumb nerd. <laughs> he can be the lady for both of us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when it comes to that. Remember, remember this? Corn wash. Like I said, he's but, weak. Yeah. We're really stomping through the well, forest now, Chip. Let's talk about, actually, Mother Leaf. Mother, mother Leaf. Sorry. Uh, mother Nature. and uh, Father Time. Father Time. Let's get to the third tweet. All right. <laughs> This is from at Tackle Talk. Again. Hashtag Tackle Talk. Has Chip got a flat earth twin? At Centopacy Gaming. Hashtag Chip and Earl Q&A. Do you believe in the round earth myth? Of course not. <laughs> round earth. <laughs> round earth? <laughs> Look around. That's completely accurate though. What are you talking about? Are you joking with me? Are you joking with me, Earl? The Earth is round. Uh, hey, oh, you put in the binoculars. Like, hey, why don't you go ahead and look? Go ahead and look. Galileo told me so many found so many years ago. Oh, Galileo told some scientists told me. So you don't believe your eyes. You believe what the scientists tell you. It, it's round. We're just very very tiny. We're little tiny little dots on it. You think I would make a flat Earth? No, because where does it end? You just fall off the end. You just drive your Mitsubishi right off the edge. Yep. There's no edge. Yeah, yeah, there is. What happens when you fall off? Is it like Rainbow Road? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Poor Earl. <laughs> he just believes everything anyone tells him. Oh, look at this. You're making quite the trail there. I am. You have to. You really have to. It's the way you track. Yeah, we got a comment in Twitch from PBJ Production. They oh. say, I use corn wash to try and cure my herpes. And ended up giving rid of, getting rid of my hemorrhoids. Such a great product. Say that product name again, Chip. That's Cornwash. Beautiful. Tackle Talk brought to you by Cornwash. You can use it to cure your hemorrhoids. And the jury's still out on the herpes. Apparently. Yeah. <laughs> Andy. Such a... Such a... Such a... Such a... Uh, <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, uh, yes, no, uh, you're right. Twerp. Yes. Well, I was trying to think of the word twerp. I knew you didn't have to say it. I, it was so obvious. Yeah. Oh, did, twerp. Did you ever see him cry? <laughs> <laughs> well, I got it on video. You did? Yeah. You got a the video other day when he, he was crying? crying in the woods. You got a Remember video what he was that? saying? He was saying, <laughs> what am I going to do? Why was he crying? Yeah, he was complaining about Tag of Talk or something. Ah, probably because we're not paying him anymore. And you know, <laughs> we took him out way far away from home. And he's got no way of escaping. And we have guns and stuff. And we're stronger. <laughs> he, he's been working for free for a few months. He's kind what of like mean. our slave. <laughs> he's a little bit. Because he's weak, like I said. He's very weak. <laughs> Remember that when I put the bow and arrow to his head? <laughs> really scared him there. Yeah. Do like, we have that clip? No. I think of I him do. crying? Yeah, no, I got do it. Do we? Yeah, I have Andy, it. Andy, do you have it? I gave it to him earlier. He's Andy? shaking his he's head no. <laughs> oh, but we do, He's though, shaking Andy. his head yes now. <laughs> yeah, no, he's got it. <laughs> Why is he smiling? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah, he's, maybe he's turning over a new leaf, too. Yeah, what a, what a, what a, what a, 
<laughs> what a twerp. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Andy, can you play that clip of yeah, you crying in the forest? I think everyone would love to see it. All right, Andy, play the clip. Chip, what are we doing out here? It's late, and we've been circling this block now for the past hour and a half. Girl, don't worry about it. I got something I got to take care of. Oh, oh, oh we're in here. Chip, take it easy. I got something I got to take care of. Oh, yeah, there it is. Chip, let's just find an abandoned parking lot so we can go to bed for the night in the back of the Girl? van. I got something I gotta do. What? Who? Who is that? Oh, I think you know who that is. I, the guy in the camouflage. Pen. You better run from me, Barry. You sack of shit. Chip. 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 Ah. Chip. Ah. I got him. I got him. Get up. Get up. Chip. Fuck you off. Just hit Get that the hell man. out of here. <laughs> Chip. Come here, Barry. Just leave me be. Chip. Come. Ah. Get the fuck on the ground. Oh, Chip. Oh, stop no. him. Earl. Oh, stop him. Oh. Chip. Oh. Stop his head. Chip. Ah. Oh, oh, stop him! Oh, well, fuck no. you, Barry! Oh, oh Barry, no! Oh, piece of garbage! Oh, right. Earl, let's, oh, go. Uh, let's go! Fuck. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Oh, Earl! Chip, you knocked me Back over! In the van. Chip, calm down! Oh, wait for me! Wait for me, Chip! Wait for me! Go, 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 go! Hit the gas, Chip! Hit the, hit the gas! Did you play it? I can't. I couldn't see it. I think he did. Did he play it? Yeah. <laughs> that must have been wasn't embarrassing that, for him. Oh yeah, wasn't that funny? Oh, boy, he, he's <laughs> Andy, he's such a He's going to be getting phone calls after that one. Sobbing. Andy, how can you be such a little baby? Sobbing and tearing. A little woman. You know? Ah, that Andy. I'll never get over it. Remember, remember huh? he said, he said, I've seen things <laughs> I never wanted to see. Like what? <laughs> I don't know. Male penises? Maybe he saw his own little dangly. Shadow. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> He's like the groundhog. <laughs> Maybe he... Hey, Andy, how many more weeks of winter we got? <laughs> Maybe he thought we were gonna like cut off his fingers <laughs> yeah. if he tried to leave <laughs> the show. Yeah. Maybe he just thought that. I did tell him <laughs> I was gonna hook him with a fishing hook in oh, his nose really? and reel him in. <laughs> I told put him, him in a net. I told him keep him in a tank <laughs> and not feed him. <laughs> I I told Andy that I was gonna take one of my arrows and shoot it with a bow and arrow through his thigh and let it bleed until he <laughs> <laughs> put a band down. What was the bow and arrow I was gonna shoot him with? <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> I was gonna shoot him with this to the thigh. <laughs> <laughs> he would have bled out because I would have hit one of his one of his vital <laughs> vital blood <laughs> blood arteries. And you find yeah, you find the trappings, <laughs> Andy trappings. Yeah, and, and then say, and just then, now, uh, and then I pee in a bucket and pour it on his head. <laughs> <laughs> This episode is brought to you by Cornwash. You can pick it up in your stores in a tub or a bucket. Cornwash. Great sunscreen. Good laundry detergent. Good laundry detergent. <sighs> that was a, that good, was a good laugh. laugh. Yeah. Uh, thanks, Andy. Andy's shaking his head now. <laughs> he always does. He's got a little smile on his face, though. Yeah. Not sure why yeah, he's smiling. He's being a good that. sport. Yeah, he's, good. Yeah, yeah, he's yeah. a good he's sport. A good when sport. it comes down to it, he's a good. Want to toss his hair for me? <laughs> when we get here, back Andy. to the van. Come we'll, here, we'll toss his hair for him. Yeah. Well, I don't think there's any animals left. I think I killed <laughs> one or two: the bear yeah. and the fox. Is that all the tweets and the calls? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's all the tweets and all the calls. Yeah. Actually, no. I think we've got another tweet. Oh. Well, that's that's the Power Ranger one this again. One? Like I said, it'd be the red one. This one? No, nope, that one too. Chip, I'm confused. I think that's all of them. All right. Well, that's probably it. I'll think all the animals are dead, Chip. Well, we're gonna have to go somewhere else then. I'm gonna shoot Andy. No, I'm <laughs> just kidding. I'm <laughs> gonna shoot Andy. <laughs> I would like no. <laughs> uh, Andy. Cornwash. Cornwash. Well, thanks for watching, everyone. This yeah. has been another great episode of Tackle Talk, in case you were unaware. Yep. And remember, you can catch us on YouTube, com slash Antopacy, Twitch.tv slash Antopacy. That's where we're streaming this. Yep. And you can donate to us. Yep. Visit our Patreon. Yeah, Patreon. That's right. Donate to us. You can donate to us. Send us your money so we don't have to kill animals for a living. Or Andy. <laughs>
<laughs> save Andy. <laughs> save Andy. <laughs> wait, wait, I got it. Hashtag save Andy. <laughs> oh, but Chip, we should really say we're, we our condolences to Barry's family. Anyways, I've been Chip Hamlin. And I've been Earl Prescott. And this has been Tackle, Tackle Talk, Talk with, with Chip and Earl. Earl. Kill that little fucker. He's dead. Yep, all right.